All right, guys, we at Shoes TV have heard a lot of buzz behind native shoes. We've seen them out on celebs, we've seen them in Hollywood. Heck, I'm wearing them right now. So I'm actually here in Orange County, California, where their international showroom is based, to go check out the shoes and find out what the buzz is all about. I'm here with Chris and Damien. Guys, question. How do you like my shoes? Love them. Love them. They look great. Okay, so tell me the history behind Native. Like, how did it get started? Uh, it was founded in 2009 in Vancouver. Actually, you're wearing one of the three original styles that we um, entered the market with. That is the Miller. Uh, we also launched with another style called the, the Jefferson, which is a little more sleek, pretty similar in style, but you can see there's more perforations. A um, little bit different fit for different customers. You want to try and fill that out a little bit. And then we also started with the Corrado, which is a little bit more of a classic kind of boot looking silhouette. Um, this has done really well with, with chefs and, and the service type business. They've really been drawn to this shoe out of the three. So what makes native shoes so different? They did a, a good thing. They took something super simple, and then but the technology behind it's pretty forward, and they married the two together. And it was kind of, um, I think it was a good time in the market. You know, there wasn't anything super fresh in the footwear market. It's been super saturated. You know, footwear has been going pretty big for the last 10 years. And uh, they just hit, they hit it at the right time. You know, it's a good price. It's comfy, and then the styling is really good. I saw earlier you guys have some boots as well, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we do. We do actually. This is <clears throat> the Fitzsimmons, which is launching. Um, this month and next month into retail. Um, this is basically designed, you know, from an old mountain shoe. This is another um, style that we launched called the Paddington. It's kind of a rain boot inspired. As you can feel, it's a lot lighter than a traditional rain boot, so it's super comfortable, good on the back, and it's effective, it's waterproof. We did um, implement a kids program for boots as well, which is, that's kind of the, the youth version of, the, of that. And then the super little guys which if you have kids, they're lovely to have. They're easy, they're washable, and they're just comfortable at the end of the day. Most recently, we added a, another style to the collection called the Jimmy Boot, um, which is doing really, really well for us. It'll hit the marketplace this next month as well. Um, you know, it's a new technology, something that's really never been done before as well. You mentioned new technology, what do you mean by that? A new technology meaning, you know, it's different kind of uppers, synthetics, canvases, uh, different, you know, denims married with a blown EVA bottom. Both concepts have been done, but they really haven't been done together well. So how did you guys get involved with Native? Like, what's your background? We worked at another footwear company together like three years ago, and it was a long drive to LA. You know, we're both from Orange County. It was a big commute, and the carpool rides, you know, we had a long time to think, and we wanted to develop something <laughs> close to home and kind of focus on what we love to do. And so we, he came up with the concept of actually doing an international showroom, you know, help taking smaller brands to the globe. And we met Native almost like the second month that we launched this. So a friend of ours that does another footwear company heard about what we were doing, met this guy and said he needed some help with the, the global sales. And we flew out to Vancouver, you know, he shot us a picture of, uh, I think it was like this shoe, and on like a Tuesday and I called him on Wednesday and we're going to Vancouver. All right guys, well that's it for today at the International Showroom for Native Shoes. Chris, Damien, thanks so much for chatting with me. My pleasure. pleasure. And if our viewers want to rock native shoes the way I'm rocking them, grab a couple pairs, mix and match, where can they find them? Uh, NativeShoes.com.